Hey guys, Xblade here, and welcome to this game. is apparently about this house that has lights, and you are apparently staying in this house from a newspaper ad and getting paid or something like that. I'm getting paid to stay in a house with lights, then I'm not complaining. But let's go. October eighth, nineteen eighty four. I saw an ad in the newspaper about a house sitting job. Since I was short on cash, I decided to sign up. 1984 with clap clap lights. Oh, this must have been like breathtaking. Quite the eerie neighborhood, huh? Wow, I love how I can't see anything in front of me. Man, I forgot my glasses at home. Excuse me for a moment, let me just take a look. Ooh, I like that. Nice uh, full trash can. What's going on, man? Excuse me, I'm trying to find a house on the street. Can you help me out? Sure, what house are you looking for? I'm looking for Maxim's place. He hired me to look after it while he's away. Maxim. Oh, that's interesting. He usually asked me to watch his place. I'm Marco Bodov Bodovsky, by the way. Nice to meet you, Marco. Can you tell me where his house is? Of course, it's two houses down. Mine's right here. Our neighbor Savo in the middle. And then Maxim's place. You can't miss it. Thanks, Marco. I appreciate it. No problem. Now, if you excuse me, I just got home from my autom- I just got my home automation system in the mail. I'm really excited. Oh, that sounds interesting. What does it do? Well, it's supposed to make a life a whole lot easier. You know, controlling the lights, temperature, even the security system. Pretty cool stuff. Wow. That does sound convenient. Why did you decide to get it? Probably because of the recent disappearances happening around here. Mainly because, because our neighbor Salvo got one and won't stop rapping about it. He left vacation right after installing it. Said he hasn't built in security systems and all. Guess he wanted to keep an eye on things while he was away. Well, I hope you enjoy setting it up. Thanks again for the directions, Marco. No problem. If you need anything, I'm just a house away. So, clap, clap lights. Clap on lights are notoriously bad. Um, yeah, they're not good. I'm pretty sure they're not great on power efficiency either. But don't take it from me. This must be it. Let me check if my trash can is full. It is. Clap, clap, certified, smart. This is like the ring signs you see on lawns. Well, hello. Hello, hello. Hmm, I think the homeowner mentioned the key should be in the backyard. All right, let's go. I am going and checking. Wow, this, my eyes must be so messed up. I think they said to put it in the, they put it in the flower pots, eh? Well, this ain't the flower pots. Ah, yes, of course. Ah! Load the wind chimes. Oh, I'm so broad. Ah, there they are. Let's see if these work. Interesting. A little dark. Here we are. How do I clap on these lights? Well, that's uh, welcoming. Yeah, it sure is. They did say it was a smart house. And ninth in the 80s is crazy. Nice hum. Wait a minute. You didn't take all your trash. Is that a wrench? What is that? Hey, thanks for house sitting. Please make sure to check the mailbox while the plants are out the trash. Plus Q on the toggle lights on and off. Once you finish, help yourself to this food in the kitchen. Let me try let me test this out. Alright. Nah, I should just get on working already, you know. Alright, never mind. I have to explore all the rooms. Clap clap. I gotta take a leak. Never mind. These look really modern for the 80s. I don't know, maybe maybe in my my sense of time has completely messed up. This looks like a Samsung washer. No, 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 it's just an 80s washer. All right, let's just close that door and enter the garage. The garage, very nice, nice. Hey, look, I have one of these. Oh, and I have a workbench and a nice uh, toolbox. You love to see it. Okay, is there a room over here? No, is there, there's a phone. A little dark up here. Do I enter? Well, I will follow exactly what that sign says and respect the homeowner's privacy. Okay, cool. Wow, so many rubber ducks. Wow, there's more. You'll love to see it. Man, the AC is running, isn't it? door is quite, uh, wow, the door stopper is really strong. 
This door doesn't open very far, huh? Alright, cool. Oh, it's too dark. Let me out. It'll close by itself. Okay. This room here. What's this say? Zoom, rotate, 300 jump scare ideas. Oh, God. Or 101. These guys are horror fanatics, I see. Hello. Nice little bedroom here. Hmm. 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 1984. Flat screen TV this size. This guy must, must be rich. Let's go do our chores. How much are you getting paid to do this again? I could have. I didn't read the newspaper myself, so I don't know. Man, the slow opening heavy door. Let's check the mailbox. What is inside? This looks especially modern for an 80s poster. I'm not going to even try pronouncing that. 25 years old, 170 pounds, 5 foot 9. Last seen September 23rd, 1984, on Southwood Park, wearing a black sweater and black hat. He was doing house sitting services. All right. Cool. I like the beginning of a mystery novel. It sure does. Grab the watering can from the garage. Okay. There it is. All right. Let's water the plant. La da dee. La da do. Must be great for barbecues, though. You know, invite the whole neighborhood over. Even some people from other neighborhoods just go to town. They seem to also like the same flower. Hi, yo, neighbor. How are you doing on this fine evening? I don't even know what time it is because I can't read the clock. But I'm guessing it's like. Catching your breath from a long evening run. I know, you know, those runs, they could be quite exhausting, especially, especially at this, uh, this time of year in October. All right, next, taking out the trash. All right, let's just throw this away. I am, uh, on high alert right now. Should be good, though. Should be good. Should be fine. Should be fine. Save the... Is that here? Is that here? I don't remember seeing that. No. Hey, man, I'm pretty sure the, uh, why are the bones sticking out? Because they're... Eating a lot of meat. <laughs> Fucking fuck you. What? Did you scare the shit out of me? I'm Agent R. Federal Investigation Bearer. Uh, I need to ask you a few questions. Sure. There are reports of disturbances in this area. Disturbances and strange phenomena. We're conducting an investigation. Yeah, I've heard. Are you sure? We have a reason to believe there's more in the neighborhood than the meat's the eye. 100% just taking out the trash, you know? All right, but keep your eyes and ears open. We need to get to the bottom of this. Thanks, Inspector. No problem. Stay safe. You don't just pop out like that, man. What the fuck? No solicitating in my house. This is not my house, but they need to add that sign now. I'm going to suggest that to them. Damn it. If, if I be bothering me. Let's just get some food. Reward ourselves after doing it. You know, these things can malfunction pretty easily, you know. I have the first model, you know, it just takes a bit to getting used to here. I don't remember the pizza box being on the couch. I don't remember turning off the lights. No, that's not... You... No horror! Why would you go upstairs after hearing a sound and the lights turning off? This is your sign to fucking leave. I am leaving. I'm gonna take this Coke. Mexican Coke. Let's see it. And I'm fucking leaving. Goodbye. Let's close the door. Indestructible glass. You love to see it. I am leaving. Neighbor is in the house. Hey. I'm gonna throw this Mexican Coke in your uh, trash can so the garbage man has something to uh, indulge on while he's doing his shifts. Hey, neighbor. Oh, I can't even go up your steps. All right, well, for a horror fanatic, 
my character, um, he's oblivious to any sign that he's gonna die. He's just an idiot. That's who he is. But okay. Let's just, let's just clap for ourselves before we die. I am preparing for the worst. Here we go. God damn it. Hello? Hello? Oh. Oh, the intruder went into the room that you weren't supposed to go into. The one room. I'm gonna leave these doors open. I should get something to eat and go to sleep. Oh, I'm supposed to stay the night. Of course. Could I enter that room if I wanted to? Oh, I could. It's really tempting, but I'm not going to. I shan't. I can't do such foolish thing. I'm gonna leave all the lights on and waste their power. Hmm. A bowl of cereal that I totally made. I don't feel like uh, cereal. I feel like eating some. Uh... Love the empty fridge, you know. Love that. All right. Well, I'm gonna eat this in the bedroom upstairs. Oh well, I did. Uh, this uh, milk is so spoiled. Can I choose which bedroom? I'm just gonna choose this one apparently. All right. Let's lay down and eat cereal with spoiled milk. Yum. Oh. I think I'm uh, dozing off a little bit. I need to finish my cereal before I hit the hay. Oh, I fell asleep. It's too late. <coughs> I'm going to wake up with even more spoiled milk. Ah. Man. 2.43 in the morning. It is a weird formatted clock. Stay in bed. FIB, I think I found your culprit. Oh, what was that? You're a little late. You're a little late to seeing him, yeah. Hmm. Last time I checked, this is a job for me, not for you. Well, you know, this is the room I'm not supposed to enter. This is the master bedroom. Every deck key, you love to see it. Be tarnished. What is this? How to get spooked to to play your game. Wow, looks like they're in a quite a rush to get the system installed. Uh, just, uh, you know, no mirror in the bathroom. Interesting. Let me use their uh, premium master bedroom toilet and take a nice cold shower. So, uh, this looks like an especially modern shower for the 80s. Don't do that. Whoa, what the hell did I just see down there? Hey. Hello. How are you doing, sir? Hey. Windows open. I'm gonna leave now. Hello? Maybe the monster realized I'm such a brave guy and... That I have nothing to harm. He finished the pizza and he brought back the coke from the trash. Holy sh! Oh, that's not bad at all. Well, actually, in adjusting for inflation, that's probably like what? Over a hundred dollars. Clapper Town. What the fuck kind of name is that? Well, if I'm gonna die, I might as well die wasting all this power. I'm not gonna figure out what's going. On. I'm gonna leave. Yeah, because I can't unlock the door from the inside. Why would I be able to do that? Yeah, why would a house need an inside lock for the front door? Sick 360, bro. You want a book? Hey, hey, what's going on, man? Hey. 
rubber ducky. I love rubber ducky. Oh. I love rubber ducky. <sighs> Whoa, I'm running now. I'm running and I'm leaving. And the door is locked. Oh, I bashed out the window and I'm running away. Oh, there goes the clap clack McGee. Neighbor, I forgot your name. I need to get as far away from here as possible. I shall. Hey, it looks like he threw his box away. He realized it was like, sh hey. Oh, maybe not. No, he's having a bit of a tough time in there. I'm going to run away as far as I can. Oh, and I ran away. And I lived. And now I'm going to tell the FIB guy that this was all I kept running until I reached the nearest police station. While investigating, the authorities found Marco's lifeless body in his house. Meanwhile, Maxim's remains were found stuffed in a trash bag outside his house. Oh. Their neighbor... Havel had disappeared under similar circumstances. His remains have yet to be found. Despite the eerie scratches on the walls and my harrowing account, harrowing account, no trace of the creature is ever discovered. The case remains unsolved, leaving an unsettling mystery behind. I think. Well! This is his first ever indie horror game. Hey, you gotta give it to him. Great game. Was short and uh, terrifying enough, but also I was expecting a big jump scare. But I guess the cheesy jump scare was kind of, I guess, too expected of. So uh, yeah, that's great. I'll leave this game in the description if you want to play it. And uh, if you want to see more horror games, if you want to see more games in general, just let me know. And uh, I'll happily play them um, if I haven't played them before, obviously. So I'll see you guys next time.